Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Osirk501, and today I want to show you guys the way I was very easily able to completely cap my cash in Borderlands 3. Now, if you don't know what that is, that's $99,999,099. And this farm, I was also using a purple artifact that gave me, I think, like 118% increased cash drops. I don't know if there's a legendary version that gives more than that, but I was using that as well, which gives a big boost. And it was on True Vault Hunter mode on Mayhem 3. Now what you're actually going to be doing is completing the Cistern of Slaughter, which is another one of the Circle of Slaughters. This one's in a Promethea, and you go to the Meridian Metroplex, and you will you should be able to see the location, the entrance on your map. And once you go to it once, you can just fast shovel there whenever you want. You don't have to, you know, go back and find the entrance again. And this Circle of Slaughter is going to be all animals. And there's not going to be near as many badasses. So it is a bit easier than the Circle of Slaughter on Pandora. Um, but there are a lot more enemies. So I would definitely have some type of AoE damage clearing build. That's going to make you go through it much quicker. I can complete one of these usually in 10 to 15 minutes. I think 10 minutes was my quickest time. Usually probably on average it's around 15 minutes to complete one of these. And the reason you have to complete it is because pretty much all the cash comes from the very end. Now, basically on the last round, on some of the last waves of the last round, there's going to be a really big group of engorged birds. I think they're racks that are flying around. They're really big ones, pretty tanky. And every time you shoot them, a bunch of cash falls out. And when they die, a ton of cash falls out. Now, some other animals throughout the the rounds will give a little bit of money but not that much and if you focus on killing all these birds and try to kill them when they're not flying off the map because you can and then you lose a bunch of money um once you kill these you'll just run around the area pick up all the cash and you'll just be getting tens of millions of cash um Basically, I think on average is 20 to 25 million if you have the artifact on Mayhem 3 and True Vault Hunter mode. I was getting around 20 to 25 million on average. I did get one where I don't think I lost any cash because they do like to fly over the edge. I think I've gotten one that was like 32 or 33 million. And with getting even just 20 to 25 million million in cash, I can personally, with how fast I clear this with my build, I can cap my cash in an hour uh, maybe an hour and a half if you know my clear is being a little bit slower if the birds fly off the edge and die and i don't get all the cash that explodes out when you kill them so that's pretty much the entire thing i don't think i've seen anybody actually talk about this because this is i think actually faster than just throwing the money grenades at each other in a duel which was i think the fastest way to get cash before this is easily the fastest way i've actually found to you know cap out your cash in borderlands 3 be careful with that though because you'll lose like 15 million the first death you get um but you really don't need cash for that much besides like slot machines after stus so that's pretty much the entire video i'm gonna leave a clip of me fully clearing one of these this isn't one of my best clears but it's a pretty good average clear with the average amount of money at the end. Um, so subscribe if you want to see more Borderlands 3 content. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below what you think about, about this farm, what you think about Borderlands 3 as a whole. And thanks for watching.
go. 